we will use a school pillar to add KHP to the LMF flask. But the problem is we don't know how much is 0.2 gram. The strategy is we add a tiny amount and get the mass. For example, when you add a tiny amount, the first measurement is about 0.100 gram. Then we will know we add roughly the same amount the next time. Let's open the side door of the electronic balance, and we place the LMF flask on top of that, and then close the door. Make sure we press the button in the center, and make sure the reading is about zero. OK, this is 0.041 gram. We roughly need 0.16 grams. Now we get 0.228. It's a little over 10%. It should work. Remember, we need to record the mass immediately after the measurement. Now we are moving back to our titration station. I need to add water to dissolve this. It doesn't matter how much water you add, but roughly you want about 25 milliliters. You can use a graduated cylinder, or you just estimate. Use a mark on this one Erlenmeyer flask. I'm not going to use a graduated cylinder, because I think I have a pretty good estimate. OK, this is 50. I added to about half, so this should be about 25. Again, 25 doesn't need to be exact. After you dissolve the KHP, don't forget to add the acid base indicator, which is this, in this small bottle. You only need to add about 3 to 5 drops. Now I'm going to add the stir bar into this LMF flask. I want to stir that so the dissolving can be very fast. At the same time, I can swirl this so it will dissolve faster. <laughs> 